Okay, I have the same problem. Um, what I've done is you go to your network and then um, you set up internet connection. It doesn't matter if you use LAN or Wi-Fi because uh, some people are saying, um, you know, like just uh, connect your PS4 to your router directly with that uh, with cable is uh, better than Wi-Fi. But it doesn't matter if you want to go for Wi-Fi, just use Wi-Fi. And then if you don't go for easy, you go custom, and then um, <laughs> you choose um, the, the network you want to use. So say I got this 5G for me, and then um, yeah, wait for a couple of seconds, and then yep, yeah, and then pretty much everything you just go to automatic. So so the IP address you go automatic. And then the DHCP you go do not specify, and then uh, DNS. So some people saying change your DNS to 8.8.8.8. That doesn't work. To be honest, that's not work for me. So you just go for automatic, everything automatic. Uh, MTU. Some people saying change the MTU to um, smaller rather than the default uh, 1500. Just go for 1472 or something, but. That's not work for me neither. So I uh, go automatic, and then uh, proxy you go do not use. So by doing custom this way, you can save all the settings. Because if you go easy, it will um it won't save all the settings. You you just um you know set on PS4, and then it will check it out. Uh, just um yeah, I I already got this one sorted, so it's everything is successful. But it, when you have the problem, you will um, you will um, successfully obtain IP address, but you don't have internet connection. It will say fail, and then um, at that stage, you go to <coughs> just real connection status, and you can see your IP address here. You have to uh, write down this IP address, cause later on you're gonna um, set up this. Um, uh, firewall thing for um, this IP address in your router because uh, the problem is actually caused by um, firewall so um, the modem is actually isolates your PS4 from uh, its internet so you, your PS4 couldn't actually exchange any data from the internet so um, you need that IP address and that will show you how you set up your um, modem Okay, so this is your control panel on your modem. Um, you have to log in your modem to change the setting for your PS4. Um, since you have your IP address already, um, so you have to permit the independent port sharing for your PS4. And then open this device completely for internet sharing via IPv4, uh, which means your PS4 gonna have the access to the internet totally. And then this is your, uh, you have to, to assign the same uh, IPv4 address for your modem on your, on your modem for your ps4 so you always assign this network device the same ip v4 uh, address uh, in this case so i set it up and then my setup is modem and then router and then ps4 connected to um, the router wirelessly wi-fi um, and then i turn off the uh, firewall on my router as well so i i think they're gonna help that's why I done that, and then um, and pretty much that's it. And enjoy.